This problem comes from the TMUA. How many solutions does the equation x tan x equal 1 have in the interval x is between minus 2 pi and 2 pi? And we've been given seven options here, 0 through 6. Now, I did a problem recently like this on the channel, and the solution is actually kind of similar. So we're definitely not going to be trying to solve this algebraically. We're going to be doing this graphically. So what I could do is try and sketch the graph y equals x tan x, but that's kind of difficult. Um, what I'm going to first notice is that x equals 0 is definitely not a solution to this equation, because 0 times 0 is not 1. And so therefore, I can just divide by x, and I'm going to get that tan x is 1 over x. And now I know how to sketch y equals tan x, and I also know how to sketch y equals 1 over x. And so I can sketch both of those graphs and look for the number of points of intersection. But in fact, I can do one more thing here, and this is a kind of a nice observation specifically for this problem, is I notice that tan x and 1 over x, they're both odd functions. And in particular, if I maybe just look at this original equation, it might be easier. x times tan x will be an even function. What do I mean by that? Well, if I call f of x x tan x, then it's not too difficult to see that f of minus x is also x tan x as well. And that means if, for example, there is some positive value of x, such that x tan x is 1, so if alpha times tan alpha is 1, where alpha is some positive number, then also minus alpha times tan of oops minus alpha will also be 1. And so therefore, I must have an even number of solutions, because any positive solution is going to have a negative counterpart. So straight away, I can eliminate those without actually doing any, any maths or any, any actual uh, sketching of a graph. OK, uh, let's work out how many there are. And also, the beauty of doing this is I only need to focus on the positive solutions. So let me sketch tan x for x between 0 and 2 pi. So uh, tan x looks something like this. You've got an asymptote here at pi by 2. If you're preparing for the TMUA, you should know how to sketch these graphs with your eyes closed. Um, so this is pi over 2. This is pi. This is 3 pi over 2. And that's 2 pi, like so. And now what's 1 over x? Well, 1 over x looks something like this. And you can see I've clearly got one solution there, two solution there. So that's two positive solutions paired with two negative solutions. The answer here is four. Hopefully you found this solution quite interesting. If you are looking to prepare for the TMUA MAT and want that extra support because you want to study at these top universities in the UK, Oxford and Cambridge, get in touch. Over 80% of my students end up studying at either Oxford or Cambridge. So if you want to be one of those people, let me know. Uh, my link is in the description below. Thanks so much for watching. I'll catch you in the next one. Have a great day.